In this first actual lesson of the course, we will work with templates. Today is all about modifying the template and creating a template for yourself that you will use throughout your work by setting the style, colors, fonts, and shapes of your presentation from the beginning, you will have a more solid and uniform looking work throughout the rest of the work that we will do together creating a presentation. Just click on create from template and a new window or tab will be open on your browser. Uh, let's choose a template together. We are not working with video templates today because we are leaving that for the Prezi video course. Don't forget to check it out. For now, let's start with the simple template. Let me find one that can work for us. Let's choose the good company template. You can always check it out first before actually selecting it. And then when you're sure that this is the template that you want, just click on use this template. It will take a moment to load uh, to configure the presentation in your Prezi account. What just happened is that you have a new presentation in your Prezi dashboard. Now that we choose our template, we end with a full structure with topics and subtopics, like here, for example, where you have your topic and then you have an extra subtopic. There are some templates that come with some content, but usually you start with a blank template in the sense that it doesn't have content. It has colors and a definition of text, but not any previous content. To customize a template, you use the style options, where you have options like the background, shapes and layouts, colors and text. All these options are global for the presentation. When you change the shape of topics, like this, for example, this is valid for the full presentation. All the changes that you made on style, it's about the style of the presentation. So don't forget that. This option, it's a, uh, I don't see much sense in it, but it's how Prezi works. It gives you a random background. You click on this and it will change the background for something else, not of your choice, just something different. And yes, you can keep going until you get the background that you want, or you can also use the option to actually configure the background, which is this small clickable icon here. And this right panel opens when we have the options to upload an image or to use images from Prezi's library. We can also get rid of the background by clicking on this trash icon. And then we have no background at all, but we still have a color. Okay. We can also customize the shape and layout of the topics. As always, you can choose randomly one or you can actually use the setting option to choose different topic shapes. This is not very clear because our topics are white. So let's change the colors. Okay, now we have more visible topics. Remember that this uh, setting is global for the full presentation. You can afterward change the shape of a given topic. But the choice you make here will be valid for the full presentation unless exceptions. I like this one very much. And this one is like for a map. This option is to change the colors. We can randomly choose any color palette or we can actually work on modifying the colors of our particular template. And this is the option for the text. The same, you can choose randomly or click here and actually choose from fonts uh, presented by Prezi. 